The first step in preparing food is to wash your hands with warm water and antibacterial soap. The ingredients you will need to make this dish are about 40 grape leaves, one pound squash, half a pound of green peas, five full garlic, two green peppers, two Anaheim chili, three onions, two eggplants, three potatoes, one can tomato paste, one can tomato sauce, two cups of rice, one teaspoon black pepper, one tablespoon baharat, a quarter cup of oil, two lemons, two cups chili meat, and a pinch of salt. You will also need a large pot, a bowl to mix the ingredients, and an extra bowl. I will begin by cutting the onions, the ends of the onions off, and making a little hole, and then, and then I will cut a slit down the middle, going only going halfway through from top to bottom. This is what your final product should look like. Then when you're done, place them in a pot. Next we're going to bring the onions to the stove and bring them to a boil. Place water inside the pot and wait for the onions to boil. Notice how the onions do not have to be completely covered by the water. While we wait for the onions to boil, we will move on to our next step. Take a green pepper and a knife and take off the stem from the top. Then you will cut the pepper in half and take out the insides. Your finished product should look like this. We'll be using the inside of the vegetables, the eggplant and the squash later. I will take a handful of salt and sprinkle it over the vegetables to bring out the moisture.
toss the vegetables around so the salt can be evenly distributed among the vegetables. Now we're going to check in on our onions. Since they are not boiling yet, we'll move on to our next step. Place the rice into a larger bowl and rinse out with water. Onions are starting to boil, but we'll wait a little longer until it becomes a rapid boil. Once the rice is drained, we'll pour it back into our larger bowl. And we'll prepare our rice. Now we're going to cut the garlic. Cut it into small pieces. Repeat this step for all the pieces. Once you are done, place the garlic with the rice. Now that the onion has come to a rapid boil, we'll drain it and allow the onions to cool. here to cool now. Let's go to the next step. I peel my potato and now I'm going to cut it into small pieces and place it into the rice. Now we're going to take the uh, insides of the eggplant and squash that we had from earlier and cut them into small pieces as well. Add those to the bowl. Continue doing this for the rest of the eggplant and squash. Add in a small amount of peas for decoration. Meat is optional. If you like to put meat inside the doma, this step is where you would put it in. Put it in raw if you do so. Now we are going to take the full can of tomato paste and put it inside the bowl. We'll do the same with the sauce, the tomato sauce. Now you'll take a handful of salt and begin sifting it over the rice. Take the black pepper and do the same thing. And the baharat. Now you will mix them all together. I 
After it is all mixed, you will go on to the next step. 